What's up guys, Raykul here and welcome to the part 2 of what's after unlocking T4. In case you didn't uh, see there was a part 1, um, I will try to link the width in the description and there's, there will also be a link at the end of this width. So uh, if you missed that one, make sure to uh, click on it and uh, just have a look because you might have missed some important information. In this part, we're, we're gonna uh, look at what researchers to focus on. So, um, a lot of players, a lot of YouTubers uh, give their opinions, so this will be my opinion. Some things might match, uh, some things might be a bit different. So, uh, let's jump into it. Um, yeah, so... Um, we don't have to talk about the economy tree because uh, you already have that um, maxed out for T4. And we don't have to talk about the military tree because uh, same thing. You already have that maxed out for T4. Uh, we will look at the other um, research trees. So uh, this will be a don't do list and a do list. So don't do defense. Uh, as you can see, I barely got anything there because um, it's basically useless. So, unless you would like to be a wall trap, uh, don't do it. <laughs> Monster hunting, do it. This is on the do list. Uh, it's very important to do monster hunting. Max it out as soon as you hit T4 because uh, it's uh, very important and it gives you a lot of gems. It gives you a lot of items, speed ups. Um, rare materials and also it generates gifts for your guild so um you it's it's not only you who benefits out of this it's the whole guild because you will be hunting monsters and killing a lot of monsters um upgrade defenses it's uh don't do unless you want to be a wall trap <laughs> so as you can see i only got a couple of researchers there and these are probably because i did some um some guild fest events of uh, quests or um, I just needed a re very very small amount of points to finish up a uh, hell event or something so um, it's on the don't do list next would be upgrade military well this is a contradiction uh, well let me put it this way you should work on this if you intend or if you have the ability to build a lot of troops basically if you're a pay to play player <laughs> um, I did do a lot of these and I will be doing a lot of these but this wasn't my priority so um, basically uh, what what um, what I wanted to get in this tree was um, was the quick swaps so um, so it's 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 annoying when you have to manually always switch around your equipment so i wanted to get those and i wanted to get bigger army one training speed um innate talent and so on um these are all great and central command uh just to show you so uh what i'm talking about and the quick swaps you can just simply uh set up your uh, talent uh your gear to uh quick swap it so you don't have to manually change it all the time it's uh it's super easy super fast so uh, if you want that do it <laughs> and um central command is uh when you're uh, sending out an army uh these are preset armies where you can also set heroes uh for example if i want to send um uh cav uh for um i don't know for a fast burn or just to gather rss it's already set up and so on and so forth um and the subsidies so you will need the subsidies in case you want to build mass troops uh very fast but uh don't focus on that and i will want that bigger army too um further down the way so Army leadership. This is another good tree, but uh, don't focus on this yet. So this is on your to-do list, but it's it shouldn't be a priority. 
Uh, plus these researchers, especially more gatherers, uh, ten and the army um, army researchers take take these take a lot of time. <laughs> Trust me, they do. Um, plus uh, these researchers you would only want to get if you're a rally lead and. Um, there aren't too many rally leads in a guild, so uh, I wouldn't say uh, focus on those just yet. Military command. I did focus a bit on this, and I'll tell you why. I wanted them. I wanted the max deposit two, and the energy limit uh, three because uh, I really needed those. But um, I wouldn't really say focus on this just yet. So once you're done with uh, with your monster hunt three, I would definitely 100% advise you to focus on familiars because this is I'd say maybe prob almost better than the monster hunting tree why because um, um, these familiars give you a lot of uh, bonuses so I only unlock this up till uh, packed for I don't want anything else just yet because I don't need those and um, I think in the part 3 we will talk about familiars and their skills so um, you should want to focus on that and I will show you later on why sigils um, you don't really need this plus it's a pay to um, pay to play uh, research tree. What do I? Hey, Reiko. What's a pay-to-play research tree? Well, um, if you click on research, you will see that uh, you require archaic tomes, and you can only get those at special events or if you buy packs. Packs. Sorry, <laughs> with real money. So, um, or with gems. But um, hey, let me show you. If you go to the gem store, go to unique. If you scroll down. Uh, let me just find it. Uh, where is it? Am I looking in the right? Yeah, there we go. So you can see that one tome is uh, 900 gems. So that's a lot. <laughs> so if you really want to focus on that tree, uh, don't. Because you don't need that. Unless you're a pay-to-play -pay player and you're in a bigger guild. You uh, really want to unlock these. Uh, you... Uh, you got the means to buy the sigils and uh, get more army attack on the rallies for uh, Wonder Wars or Baron or Emperor or what else. And um, yeah, this is good for rally leads basically or people who can afford to attack a lot. So um, just don't do this yet. And Wonder Battles, this is again the same thing. So you need uh, the Archaic or Hayek Tomes for this and um, you I already showed you the costs for that so um, try to skip this plus um, there's a good pack in the store usually I think it's only if you buy the five dollar pack that's that's quite okay let me just see if it's here at the moment no no uh, you got a lot of gems with it and um, just a sec yeah, there we go. It's this one. So it's five dollars. You get a lot of gems. You get uh, some tomes, uh, which is good, fifty, and you get a good good amount of chests. And plus, you get champion chests, slayer chests, and um, the rest. So this is all good stuff. So if you can afford uh, paying five dollars here and there, then uh, I would suggest to buy that pack because it's good. <laughs> Yeah, and um, researchers, so I wouldn't really suggest focusing on sigils and wonder battles unless you really need them or your guild needs you to do those. Um, yeah, guys, so um, I hope this gave you a good idea. So just a, good, uh, just a fast recap, focus on monster hunting first and focus on familiars. And in the next bit, I will show you why you should focus on familiars because uh, they will give you a lot of bonuses and then uh, after these two are done I would suggest focusing focusing on uh, army leadership upgrade military maybe military command and um, 
then sigils wonder battles and last uh, should be defense and upgraded defenses if you really want to get those uh, re those done uh, because they will also pump your might and it will be um, a bit harder to migrate you know uh, that stuff so I hope this helps you guys and uh, see you in the next episode. Rakel over and out.